Jordan, are we there yet? Not quite. Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Not quite. I wonder why nobody ever invites me on their boats. Maybe it's because I ask them, are we there yet? <laughs> anyway, we're out on Jordan's boat on a little pond uh, trying to do some live bait, bluegill, bobber fishing by sticks. We were planning on doing it over there by the weeds, um, but there's no weeds and the lake's down like three feet. But my buddy Frankie and I come out here every year or so and do pretty well on the weed lines but today we don't have any weed lines and we don't have frankie we have jordan but we also have bluegills so let's give it a shot and stuff good morning you dirty old stash stains it is me it is jordan and i am on a boat i can't stand up though because i'm scared i'm gonna fall out so i'm just gonna be sitting the entire time i'm just kidding i'll stand up eventually but yeah we're on a boat we're gonna be doing some channel cat fishing. We might uh, also catch some bass or something because we're using live bluegills. Problem with our live bluegills is we couldn't really catch any small ones. I know that doesn't sound like that big of a problem, but it kind of is when you want to use them as live bait. I think the smaller the better because then smaller fish can eat it and so can big fish and just a big bobber going down with a live bluegill is just exciting. It's exciting stuff. It's always been one of the more exciting things to me about fishing. And um, yeah, maybe it's because I'm a child or maybe just because a bobber going down is pretty cool, but. We, uh, we're gonna try uh, shallow first, but we might give up on the shallow and move a little deeper. So come along with Jordan and I, let's see what we can get figured out. Maybe catch some bass, but uh, hopefully for sure, catch some big old kitty fish. Maybe even a 20. During ice season, we kind of had a quest for a 20 pounder that just kind of never ended. So we'll continue it right now. And stuff. <sighs> Shove the pole ski in. Get the pole ski in. Oh, Jordan, I almost went in. Yeah. We gotta get the power pole in, but like Jordan said, the power is us. We are the power. Yeah. Alrighty, poles are out, make sure live bait and cup bait. See what happens. See what crappens. And stuff. That was fast. I can't even get it out, Jordan. Is he still on there? He's stuck now though. He's giant, we might have to go get him. Dude, that, I just looked up and my bobber was just gone and bent. He went like way to the side too. My bobber was right there. Oh really? Uh-huh. Like it'd been down for a while. He's still on there, but he's really stuck. Uh. <laughs> you pulled the boat so hard. <laughs> He's pretty stuck. He's definitely still on there. Jordan, should we go try to get him? We're gonna go see if we can get Bud out. <laughs> Might have came off though. Nope, he's still on there. He didn't like when I started pulling either. Come here, friend. What if it's like a 30 pounder, Jordan? <laughs> he's still, still in there. Oh, there he is. There he is. He better be decent. I think he is though. Oh. <laughs> just by the way he hit it, man. Yeah, he just big old head one. folded it. That's a giant. All right. All right. Not in the live gill like we planned, not in the shallow water weeds like we planned because there's no weeds and the shallows are too shallow, but medium depth brush pile, channel kitty on a bluegill head under a bobber. And we didn't even get to see the best part, Jordan. The bobber going down. <laughs> yeah. Got him now. I did, he did get git. I'm guessing it's a teener for sure, eh? 13. I'm guessing maybe even 15. All right, all right. My scale takes its time. 
1347, Jordan. Nice. Bleeding like an SOB, but I think it's just from his mouth. <sighs> All right, well, definitely wasn't uh, instant. We had to up anchor to get this dude, but yeah, 13 and a half pounder. Searching for a 20, but we'll take him any day. Glad we got him out. Maybe we'll see the next Bobby boy go down there, Jordan. But now that we got a bite, well, I mean, maybe pay attention. I'm not really <laughs> sure. <laughs> anyway, we got to go figure out somewhere else to get anchored. We kind of drifted past the trees we were at, but do it again. Do it again. And stuff. Oh, shit. Bottom got hit. Can't tell if it's done getting hit, but it did get hit. Did you see that? Yep. Got him. Drag's kind of loose. I don't think he's giant. I think he's just a little channel rat, but we'll take him. He's grown a little bit, I think. I don't know if he dropped it and came back or if he just was sitting with it the whole time. Get up here, you punk. Oh, he's growing. <laughs> Get in here, mad cats, hashtag. <laughs> did you see what that mad cats did to that 10 pounder, Jordan? Did. Owned him. If you ain't mad cat and you ain't even fishing, Jordan, you might as well stay home. I'm just kidding. It's a decent rod, but I think cat fishermen get too caught up in brands of poles. At the end of the day, they're all just broomsticks that can probably hook a channel rat. It is a pretty colored broomstick though, Jordan. It's green. Uh, and the pole holder held up. Look how fat that thing is. I wonder if it is spawning. No, I think this one's a lady. Eh, debatable. Slimy though. Why do they got the, they feel slimier than normal. This dude's a greaser. 10 pounder probably though with that gut. Yeah. When it first surfaced, I thought it was like a five or something. You were getting the fillet knife sharp, calling it an eater. Thought we were having catfish nuggets for dinner, but he grew up a little bit. All right, well, Jordan's still got a live gill out. That's currently being a dickhead, actually, now that I look at him. But we really want to catch a fish on a live gill today, so we're going to have to uh, take some time to go get some mo here eventually. I mean, we started with like 10 an hour ago. I'm not sure what happened to them. Is there a hole in your basket, Jordan? Are they escaping or are we just casting them off too much? <laughs> yep. We need Mo. We'll get him eventually. Oh shit. Giant, I think. It seems pretty big. I just threw that one back out and the pole holder came out, but I got him. <laughs> dude, that thing about stole that. Sick. I don't know if I had my camera on, but I just caught a bass fish a little bit ago. Oh, he's trying for the anchor line. He was kind of mangy and only, what, Jordan, 15 inches or something? Like a pound. Yeah. Should have been two, but he was all gross and decrepit. Just bending the mad cats, Jordan. I kind of have the butt of the rod on my dick and it's starting to hurt this thing's fine so hard. <laughs> I mean, the average size is just terrible. Uh-huh. Yeah, maybe. Kind of skinnier, but definitely a big dog. 
and definitely hurt my right testy, but worth it. Should we try my nice new phone that's gonna die and see if we can get some sweet footage, Jordan? We might have to switch sides. You guys commented how you liked Jordan's video footage on my flathead. So I went and bought a new phone just because of that. <laughs> oh no, there's a damn glide bait down there in my backpack now. Holy shit. You need to chill, bro. I'll get him. You're good. We'll get him weighed and get him back and we can figure out our disaster we got going on here. <laughs> what a dickhead. <laughs> oh no. Definitely skinnier, but definitely longer, I think. Why does the scale take so long? <coughs> you're right, Jordan. You're better at guessing. Definitely bigger than 13. 14. 14. 74. 1474. I don't know if it's just the time of year or just because they got done spawning, but their slime coat is like thick. <clears throat> How does it look on the new phone, Jordan? I'm just kidding. I didn't get a new phone just for this, but I got a new phone because for the past month, only half of my screen worked. It was annoying, but almost a 15. Burr, burr, burr. Mad cats. <laughs> um, but yeah, 40 pound leader, 65 pound mainline, seven aught, six cents, octopus circle. Yeah, you heard it right. They make catfish hooks. Did you know that, Jordan? I don't know if they're for sale yet, but they do exist. They do exist. But this cluster has been pretty good for us. I got two bobber bites right off the bat, and then we just switched to the back side of it. And um, third bite on the bottom pole, throwing this direction. Oh, mad cats. Hashtag mad cats, Jordan. It's swimming to the side with it. Got it. Oh, I fudged that up, Jordan. I might have even broke off. That thing was going. Absolutely going. I totally should have waited, but there's so many sticks over there, I didn't want to wait. <laughs> Nerve wracking stuff. All right, we'll just run a few poles for a little bit and then, well, actually, we'll let's try to catch some bait while I got a pole out. Only allowed two lines and ponds in Nebraska. So might as well be legal. Yep. That stung though. That seemed like a pretty big one. Ouchie. Yeah, like three zip here. I should be like, I should at least be four zip. That was a fucking bite and a half, man. See that thing scooting to the side fast as fuck. Then I finally caught up to it. The head shakes were insane. It doesn't seem like the small ones are shallow, Jordan. There's a lot of small ones in this lake and they gotta be somewhere, but apparently they aren't here. Alright, I guess that'll have to work. Still not where I wanted, but... Jordan? I got one instantly. I hit him in the head. Yep. <laughs> I didn't think that was really happening, but it was, man. I think this is the smallest one yet. Hard telling, but he did hit it within seconds of it hitting the bottom. Like two seconds. Jordan, if this doesn't make you want to buy a Mad Cats, I don't know what will. I'm right <laughs> Hopping on the onlines. The conversion of catching a bluegill to chopping it up and throwing it out was uh, less than five minutes. Probably like two minutes, man. I must have hit that little doinker in the head. And he's not even a little doinker, but he's definitely the doinkiest one yet. Throwing these rods in the lake. <laughs> yeah. Is that somebody else's line or like. Oh, that's the fing net. How did the net. I was wondering why. He must have been hooked all the way through. Man. 
piece of the net was up inside of his <laughs> brain. <laughs> Yee! Beep, 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 beep. I mean, oh shit. I mean, still probably getting close to that eight, nine, ten pound mark. We were talking about moving, but I'm not sure if that's happening. I think there's a pile of them in those trees, man. We ain't staying here forever though, but definitely for now. I can't get it out. <laughs> Jordan, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Mad cats. <laughs> I never seen a madder cat in my life, Jordan. <laughs> Holy balls, man. I had that sitting out there like for a while before I got hit the first time. But it sat there for like 20 minutes and then got hit and then now it's just, I need to get this back out. <laughs> Jordan, you wanna throw it out and hold it? Okay. Oh shit, we still got the fish. I kind of forgot about him. <laughs> <laughs> Too excited, dude. That was instant. I thought the boat was swaying both times, but nope. Just kept bending. Man, I love channel cats. They're just so mean. You aim for those three on the left, right in front of them. Eh, probably good enough, honestly. I must just be knocking them on the head, Jordan. They're home and you're intruding. Mm-hmm. That was crazy. Whew. Hoo hoo. You sick of it? <laughs> oh. Got him. Instant lighter line and he's in there <laughs> dude I'm talking about a school he's either really big or he's tiny I don't know he's acting funny though small one Jordan I'm sorry no. <laughs> um how do we get you one should we go get it out you can always go get your, well. <clears throat> Bye, little friend. I definitely think you need to get another rod going. Maybe even a bottom. Oh, oh. Jesus. <laughs> Jordan, <laughs> what is happening, man? Jordan catch. <laughs> I get one. Yeah, I know. We're definitely on to something, you know. Yeah. Not exactly how we anticipated. Nope. But it's, it's now. The live bluegill on the bobber certainly did get ate pretty ferociously, but that tactic's kind of gone downhill since the beginning. The size is starting to go downhill too, but <clears throat> that ain't nothing to shake a stick at, Jordan. 
I about to cook myself? <laughs> All right, we're gonna we're gonna keep going. Jordan's gonna re-rig once I can find my leader line. I think the channel beat the tar out of it. Jordan, next time this Mad Cat bends, I'm not touching it. It's either going in the water or it's actually snagged now. Got it. Lost my bait. Anyway, we need to get our poop in a group and get back to catching. Hopefully, I just chummed a bluegill head out there for him jordan keep him entertained <laughs> oh mad cats was getting hit i think you want to come get her jordan she's still doinking with it i believe yeah. <laughs> I didn't want her to get too far in there. Seems pretty decent, eh? Yeah. It, it actually looks big. You want to hop up? I'll grab the net for you. There's something about that crevasse, Jordan. <laughs> Dude, that crevasse is ridiculous. Just beating the tar out. That might be big dog of the day. <clears throat> that might be an upper teenager. How many of them are in that one little pocket? We're throwing to all sides oh, of it. It's like we both one on the same half. Dude, that's ridiculous. He's kind of getting mangier, but he's long and... He's got a big head. Yeah. You caught one. Him up here yeah he's pretty big he's got a cool color to him too he's like pinkish i'm just so bad at guessing channels and i'm not even gonna say nothing i do know we got our bait back which is cool he's kicking your ass jordan it takes its time it's climactic 11 points. Point. Oh, 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 something happened. Does <laughs> this break? I don't know, probably. That thing's a piece of shit. What Looks like... <laughs> the last one we waited, eh? <laughs> no. I don't know. I mean, them Rapology scales are kind of trash for 50 bucks, but I don't know if I've ever seen that happen to one. <laughs> yeah, I think that's how much they cost. Oh, does it? The channel just unscrewed, unscrewed it. Now you're in the game, Jordan. Now you're in the game. I'm flipping this bobber in that hole, though. I do know that. And stuff. Oh. 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 Got him. Think it's a big dog. Dude, this is nuts. that scale screwing in or no no busted because this might be a wear <laughs> but that's okay i don't know if it's just the uh bass pole or what but it seems pretty decent This one might be big dog of the day, man. We won't ever know, but we can probably be pretty good judges of it. <laughs> He's not too big, but he sure is giving this bass rod a run for its money. Sick, Jordan. Bass boat into a cat boat. It's getting some cats in it today, my friend. Another just runt 10 pounder. 
just kidding, but it's starting to kind of feel like that. Yeah, maybe it's not a 10. I don't know why, I just thought it felt like a bigger fish. It was not though. Probably wouldn't have even bent the Mad Cats, Jordan. Where'd that land, left of the hole or in the hole? That's all right. It won't take long for it to get eight and I can throw the bobber back in there. Are you gonna get the Mad Cats one? I don't know if I want it to be all me, Jordan. I'm scared. Got one. That is so ridiculous, man. Have you ever seen anything like that? Like pitching trees for bass, except they're 10 plus pound channel rats. Ridiculous. Yeah. <laughs> like pitching slip corks at the trees for bluegills, except they're eating bluegills. <laughs> Thanks, Jordan. Holy. This thing out of here before he breaks the scale even more. Ridiculous is right, Jordan. That's a serious dump. That was a disgusting bite. Big dog. Uh, you got him away from my lines for now. Looks like a pretty big dog. Good shit, Jordan. Something out. Good shit. For a while there though, I was telling you what I figured out and it wasn't working. Now you're on, now you're on them. Still waiting for the real big giant one to show up. Are you ever gonna go bass fishing again? Nope. Your little bass fishing boat's getting a run for its money today, Jordan. That's a good one. Yeah, that thing's fat. Yeah, that might be like a... Yeah, who knows? We'll never know, but... <laughs> pretty good one, though. It's off to the side of where it was. I can tell you that for free. It's like way left of where it was. <laughs> Look at that big old noggin, Jordan. No. Nope. He's... Got him. Double. Double yeah. He like pulled it like 30 feet to the right. This is just disgusting. This is Jordan, we have a double, man. Get that thing back. I'm just kidding. I don't know how we'd even take a picture. Mine's going to try to mate with yours, Jordan. <laughs> Mad cats. <laughs> no, nah, I'm not ballsy enough for that. Maybe. You think I can do it? Mad cats! <laughs> oh God. What a fest. You're gonna have to wash your boat, Jordan. Yeah. I mean, I've done a fair share of channel catting in my day, Jordan, but this is up there. A little less than that, probably. I caught one a little smaller, but. He's on the bottom of the totem pole for sure. <laughs> my bobbers. That's a sign to go get the bobber. Yeah. All right, my bobbers stuck. We're ending this video. We just beat the tar out of them. There had to be like, I mean, we caught a few hundred pounds. I doubt I left them all in, but we done. Wrecked them. At first, it was just me wrecking them. <laughs> Starting to feel real bad for Jordan, but. It's kind of a, a normal thing when we go fishing. Not always, Jordan. Not always, but. 
I think the rest of the day is going to be your day. But if you like this video, give this video a thumbs up, leave a comment, subscribe. Check out Jordan's channel. My camera's going to die. We're going to fish a little bit more, maybe just for fun. Or if we find something just as good in some of the other trees, maybe we'll, we'll make a video later. But thanks for watching. Channel cap beat down at the greasy old farm pond. Farm pond in the middle of nowhere that's public. So still kind of an accomplishment and stuff. I knew I was pulling too hard. Oh, no. <laughs> it broke into four pieces. Oh, not my bobber rod, Jordan. Not my... Oh, no. My poor pole. It was already missing eyes, but... Or guides. It's missing a lot of things now. Oh, my God. I think I can still use it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> What a start, Jordan. What a start. <laughs> <laughs>